Hello everyone, I am Sai Jitane. Welcome back to my channel, Sai Taker. In today's video, I'll try to outdo the PUBG HDR Plus Extreme settings using the screen recording and playing the game at same time. So this is a question which was asked by one of my subscribers that asking me to uh, make a video on this particular topic as you can see here friends. So every time I, uh, I get a new new comments about the asking me to make a video on this MI11X device, I'll take the screenshot and I'll try to keep in my gallery application all the screenshot which I am uh, due to, uh, for making a videos on this MI11X device friends. So make sure to comment below as well definitely i'll pick your comment and i'll try to make a video on that particular comment as well so it doesn't matter how much uh, silly it is so make sure to comment definitely i'll do my best uh, if I have the time to do definitely I'll do my best uh, in terms of testing on this phone as well So previously I did a uh, gameplay test using the Jensen impact friends So while playing the Jensen impact and using the screen recording at same time So try to watch this video you'll get a very shocking results So where the game did not perform very good So after watching this video a lot of users they did ask me to uh, do the testing on the PUBG game as well while playing the HDR plus extreme settings so I thought of uh, including the PUBG game as well in this kind of comparison. So right now the battery percentage is kind of close to 100%. So uh, battery should not be any kind of problem here. So let's see friends uh, what will be the results are uh, right now. So first is that let me even try to go to the screen recording settings. So there are two different types of uh, users. So one who uses the screen recording at uh, 60 FPS and one who uses the at 30 FPS. So first let, let's select with the 60 FPS. So let's see with the 60 FPS of recording what will be the results are. So these are my default settings which I'm trying to use right now. I did select the fixed frame rates as well. It will maintain try to it will try to maintain the exact 60 FPS all the time. So let me try to uh, open the game again so here's the game let me even show you hdr plus extreme settings so this is a question uh, exactly as it is asked so right now i'm trying to uh, do this kind of gameplay test friends so let's see uh, what will happen uh, when we start the game i'll try to uh, start the screen recording as well once the game has been begin so we'll get to know the results for ourselves so let me even try to turn on the real-time fps meter so you will be able to see the temperature readings so this is a real-time uh, FPS meter which is, which is available in the phone so which is very much useful in terms of seeing the real-time feedback so if you uh, don't know how to enable that real-time feedback so try to watch this video friends so which I uploaded just yesterday alone as you can see so try to check that video you'll get the clear idea how you can actually uh, add the real-time FPS meter so here's a PUBG game uh, right now I'm trying to play in the HDR plus extreme settings the game has been uh, begun so let me try to start uh, screen recording from here itself so before starting the screen recording let's see the real-time FPS meter so right now you're getting about 60 fps no issues so let me try to start recording so now the video is recording overall as you can see the time has been begun here you can see your friends clearly so now i cannot uh, I, I did not experience any kind of lag but let's see what happens uh, when the game begins so that is a real question it is and meanwhile you can focus on the real time fps statistics on the top here so try to focus on the top fps count so which I'm getting about uh, 60 FPS, so no problem, 60, 58. So till now there is no issues and the screen recording is going in the background as well, as you can clearly see here. So it's trying to maintain exactly as it is, so no problem at all in terms of the playback. So in the Jensen Impact, what has happened is that uh, if you use the screen recording and play the game at same time, so uh, the game started to go up to 20 FPS, 20 FPS and 30 FPS as well. But that's not the case in the PUBG games. So overall, it was uh, able to survive good till now. There is no issues, friends, in terms of the PUBG uh, gameplay right now. As you can see, friends, clearly. So no problem in terms of the PUBG uh, right now gaming. So overall, you can see 60 FPS is going on currently exactly on the top. Even you can focus on these real-time statistics, so which are accurate uh, as well. let me try to uh, run again and i'll try to show you friends so uh, i did this kind of testing before as well using the screen recording so uh, i didn't face any kind of issues before as well so this is my uh, third time of do, uh, playing the pubg game and recording at same time so till now no issues at all in this phone so usually when there is a problem it uh, we, will be easily detected with it uh, within one minute of playing the game so let me try to start running sorry uh, let me try to uh, click again and start running the game and show you the real-time FPS count how much I'll be getting here. 
as you can see the real time fps meter it's getting about 60 fps and you can see the temperature readings it's trying to increase so i think in the beginning it was close to 40 degrees around but now the temperature is trying to increase to 44 degrees 44.5 degrees as you can see 44.4 right now so if you're using real time uh, fps meter sometimes you do get this kind of uh, annoying messages so just for the demonstration purpose i did enable and the temperature started to increase so you can see the temperature it's increasing so no issues friends if there is an issue with the 60 fps then i thought of testing with the 30 fps but if 60 fps is working fine while recording then absolutely friends no need to even uh, go with the 30 fps as well it should be completely fine with the 30 my whole point of doing this video is the two things so first is there any lag in, uh, is there any lag or any kind of problems in the pubg game or not so there is no problem and second the temperature how much the temperature will be increasing in this phone if you're using the screen recording and playing the pubg game at same time so that is the second one so second one let's test right now so till now of the gaming within this uh, i think maybe five minutes of gaming the battery on the phone temperature increased to 45 degrees as you can see friends 45 degrees it went up to 45.3 degrees so that is what i'm trying to test uh, what will be the maximum temperature it can actually reach while gaming pubg game in this phone 45.4 so as you can see friends, this is where i'm, I'm seeing the results 44.4 45.5 as you can see it's trying to increase friends the temperature so if you are trying to use the screen recording and play the game so let me even try to show you the screen Brightness I'm trying to use only at uh, maybe 80 percentage, not much. So this should not be much deal. So 80 percentage should be okay most of the time, even though. So 45.6, as you can see, 45.9. So I bought the another uh, temperature reading meter as well. So in case if you're if you are any having any kind of doubts with the inbuilt uh, temperature reading, so right now you can see 40. 3.44 degrees in the front side you can clearly see friends 44 degrees on the back side in the camera area so let's focus only on the camera part so camera area it's showing about uh, 42 kind of and uh, let's see friends where it's de detecting more so uh, 39 42 41 43 as you can see 43 So it's showing about 44.1 as you can see 44.1 but on the screen in the fps meter it's uh, showing about 46 degrees as you can see friends so right now it reached up to 46 degrees so let's see whether uh, it will be able to reach more than 46 or not so that is what uh, i'm looking after so yes it is trying to reach more than 46 as well so 46.1 the time of screen recording is about uh, three minutes of time so in three minutes of time the phone temperature increased up to 46.2 so uh, even before i did start the screen recording so overall you can give the time up to uh, maybe six to seven minutes so within six to seven minutes of screen recording the temperature can go uh, close to 47 degrees friends so right now i'm trying to play the still playing the game at hdr plus extreme settings using this kind of uh, method and screen recording so no problem with the gaming so gaming there's uh, no no issues with the gaming so you can even track the real-time fps meter on the display itself so which always uh, shows about uh, 60 fps and 57 fps throughout the time of gaming without any kind of issues as you can see here so no problem with the gaming so 46.6 degrees the temperature increased 46.7 so I'll try to play the game for some time and I'll try to show you friends again the results of uh, what will be the results again. As you can see friends right now the temperature reached up to 48 degrees which is showing on the real time FPS meter. But let me try to check with the no normal actual uh, temperature reading how much it can actually detect right now. So this is after uh, 8 minutes I think close to 9 minutes. So overall from the beginning I think uh, maybe 10 minutes of 10 to 9 minutes of uh, screen recording and playing the PUBG game 46.7 degrees it's trying to detect. 46.3 as you can see 46 degrees friends on the front side so it's kind of close to 47 degrees because it's kind of 46.8 which is the highest so far detected so 46.7 so overall the phone reached up to 47 degrees uh, by using this meter and if you look at the real time fps data so which says about 48 uh, degrees right now so let me need to get down and let me need to walk and uh, show you the obvious experience of gaming even after 10 minutes of screen recording 
and with 48 degrees how is the performance of this phone whether it's got affected or not as you can see the real time fps statistics is about uh, 60 fps i think i am getting about as you can see when 60 fps is playing successfully so without any kind of problem at the moment uh, with this phone so it should not be any big deal the performance will not get affected so that is what friends the performance is not getting affected but only thing is that uh, the phone is getting kind of heat and right now i was able to see little bit drop in the fps but uh, right now it's trying to maintain as well sometimes as you can see sometimes dropping below 50 sometimes now i can notice the fps meter decreasing but there, in the in the game there is no kind of a uh, lag which i experienced in the jensen impact in the jensen impact the lag is a lot so there is a lot of lag going on in the jensen impact but in this game there is no lag at all so that's it friends. this is a quick review on this phone and the temperature keeps on increasing at all so 48.1 let me need to stop the screen recording friends so this is what happens if you uh, use the screen recording and play the game so within 10 minutes of time the temperature went up to 48 degrees as soon as i stopped the screen recording the temperature started to decrease even though i continuing the game so right now it's trying to decrease the temperature so before it started to increase 48.1 immediately when i stopped the screen recording it decreased the temperature so 47.9 so this is what happened so overall the performance is not got affected but the temperature is the one which is getting really high if you use the screen recording and play the pubg game with the hdr plus extreme settings so thank you for watching this video friends for more interesting videos make sure to subscribe to my channel so as i said the temperature is increase decreasing right now because i stopped the screen recording only this happens when you're using screen recording and playing the game at same time so if you just play the game the temperature might go only up to 44 degrees around so not maybe 43 degrees but not much so if you're using screen recording the temperature will go up to 48 degrees so thank you for watching this video friends so this is what i, I want to conclude and see you in the next video for more details until then bye